Hey guys, what's up? It's me, Elise, and I'm back with another video on a wig that I bought on Amazon. I know you girls addicted, but don't judge me though. <laughs> uh, but yeah, um, I bought this hair from the seller called We Candy. We Candy. Um, I don't even know how to pronounce it. Cause the only thing I do know is that on the box it says Weekend. So I think they meant Weekend. But we're not going to judge them, right? We're better than that. We're, we're not going to judge. Um, but yeah, um, I did decide to get a full lace wig this time. And you guys are noticing that I'm just bleaching the knots. I'm doing what I always do. Um, so I decided to get a full lace wig because it's been like forever since I last had a full lace wig. So I'm just going in and I'm bleaching the knots. And I noticed that there's like this fabric material at the crown of the wig. And I don't even really know why they put that there because that kind of took away from the whole parting experience. Like if I want to part my hair all the way down the back, that little piece of fabric just, you know, it just messed it all the way up. So I would advise you guys just to get a, a lace front wig because not only is it cheaper, um, I want to say it was like 106 bucks. Um, mine's caught, or full lace wig was $126. So um, save your coins and just get some tracks in the back. Um, but as you guys can see, I did bleach my knots. I over bleached my knots. And this is the main reason why I kind of didn't want to get this video out because I felt like, you know, it wasn't um, the best job that I could do. Um, but I can let you guys all know please do not leave your bleach on for like more than five, 10 minutes if you're using a 40 volume developer. Um, if you're gonna use a 10 or 20 volume, um, you can leave it on for about 15, 20 minutes, but I have 40 volume and I left it on for like 20 minutes and it completely, you know, bleached my roots. And um, we're gonna fix it though. It's a really easy way how to fix it. But if you guys stay tuned, you guys will see exactly how I do that. But I'm just going to go ahead and lay the baby hairs. And I'm only doing this to disguise the lace. I know it's a little <laughs> crazy looking, but um, I just use the baby hairs just to cover up the lace. But here is what my wig looks like. And yes, when you first take this wig out the box, you will notice that it is extremely thin. This wig is only 130% density. Um, and I did notice that a lot of the reviews that were on Amazon, the wig was looking very thin. Um, but I'm gonna show you guys how to make it look thicker. Um, but I was just showing you guys what the inside of the cap looks like since it, again, it is a, a full lace wig, showing you guys that fabric, but yeah. And go ahead and get the wig on and this is what it looks like um yes again i'm going to show you guys how to make the hair look voluminous but right now we're going to go ahead and correct our little over bleach issues along the roots of this wig so i'm taking a little bit of my black eyeshadow and i'm just going to apply it to where you know the bleach is peeking through if you want to permanently correct this issue just use a, a semi-permanent black hair dye put a little bit on a mascara wand and just brush out the roots trying your hardest not to get it on the lace um but yeah i just use eyeshadow it's fine um, but right now I'm just taking a comb and I'm just picking out the roots. This is the easiest way to make the hair look more voluminous. Again, when you first take the wig out your box, it's going to be so thin. It, I almost returned it because I thought it was extremely thin. Um, but all you got to really do is shampoo and condition the hair, let it dry and just pick it out some. It'll grow in size, I promise you guys. Um, but this is what the hair looks like. It's super flowy, it's super soft. Um, yeah, um, again, I wasn't too sure if I wanted to get this video out, but you guys insisted that I did, so here it is. Um, but yeah, just let me know what you guys think, and I'll talk to you guys on the next video. Bye, guys.